of uh, domestic households sometimes have a problem with actually doing the simplest of things again that is actually cooking rice um, sometimes it can burn sometimes it can be overcooked it can be undercooked not cooked at all so really there's there's three important things with rice and that is the ratio of rice to water it's the temperature and it's to have a little bit of faith in what you're doing so what I found here is the simplest of thing is if you take a pan the rice, and then mark up on the rice the twice, the twice the depth that the rice is at. So it's a ratio of two parts water to one part rice. That is round about twice the depth just by looking at it. On the heat, turn that up. You don't want it to boil though, it just really needs to simmer. You boil rice, you evaporate the water, and you lose the actual two to one ratio. But if you let it simmer, or semi-steam if you like, the rice will actually then absorb the water and it will remain fluffy, as, as rice should be. And to help along with that, we use a, just a sheet of cling film over the top. And this does two things, it gives you an airtight seal, and also, enables you to see what's actually happening inside the pan so should it start to boil then we can actually turn down the down the power and just put it on a gentle simmer and that's all there is to it once it is actually cooked then you can start adding things to it cardamom uh, saffron uh, stegma as well just to give it that delicate yellow color and not, in, not forgetting, of course, the salt and pepper to it. Just to season it, last thing, just be, remain nice and fluffy.